Hello guys, it's Laura and you are watching Laura X Annie and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing the Holly Jolly Christmas tag. I have a jumper on, I have the questions here, I have the fairy lights and the tinsel and let's get right into it. So, first question is, favourite Christmas movie? My favourite Christmas movie is... a good question. What is my favourite Christmas movie? Oh my god, I don't actually know what my favourite Christmas movie is. Probably Saving Santa. Um, I like that. No, do you know what my favourite Christmas movie is? The Santa Claus. The Santa Claus 1 through 3. I just love that with um, Tim Allen. I just do love the Santa Claus. So that might actually be my favourite Christmas movie. Number 2. Are you on the naughty or the nice list? Nice list? Obviously. Actually, probably naughty. I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm on the naughty list. <laughs> Number 3. Show us an embarrassing Christmas photo. I don't have any on hand, but I will insert a few here that are probably very embarrassing. I'm going to have to go downstairs and look in the photo albums and try and find a couple. But I will insert a couple here now. Enjoy the embarrassing Christmas photos. There you go. Right, number four. Have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes. Uh, we had one in like 1997, then another one in like 2008. Eight, I want to say and actually last year 2018 we had a very white Christmas well I did Air didn't Sterling did <laughs> we had a very very white Christmas up at my uni um, um, like to the point where it was constantly snowing and it was amazing so yeah we had a very white Christmas last year which was lovely number five do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or wait until um, the last minute now I am a Christmas shopping done in November to keep a girl but it really depends because obviously I'm a student and then if I do work I work part time so really I don't have like a lot of money to save up for Christmas shopping but when I do get a proper job I will probably be doing my Christmas shopping like Black Friday or beforehand um, I'm never a last minute gal but my money doesn't come in until like my money's not in yet so I can't buy any Christmas presents. I have a couple of Christmas presents sitting in my room but um, I want to wait until I can get loads of wrapping. I barely have any wrapping either. Do you know how stressed I am about this? I usually have all my Christmas wrapping done by the 1st of December. None of it's done! Two bits of it is done and that is for my little brother to send away this weekend so I'm freaking the feck out. Hopefully by the time you see this my um, my money will have been in by this time and I will have bought Christmas presents, I promise. Number six. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Ooh, that's a good question. I don't know what Christmas movie I'd want to be in. Maybe The Grinch? Uh, my mind is blanked on Christmas movies at the moment. Um, maybe Nightmare Before Christmas? Yeah, I'd love to be in The Nightmare Before Christmas. I'd love to be one of the animated creatures in Nightmare Before Christmas in Halloween Town, going to Christmas Town and thinking this is amazing. So probably that Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, number seven, name all of Santa's reindeer. Rudolph, Comet, Dasher, Prancer, Dixon, Blitzen, <laughs> I don't know all of Santa's reindeers. I am 23 and I do not remember them. Number eight, when did your family put up the Christmas tree and who decorates it? So we, it differs from year to year. It's kind of changed over the last couple of years because my grand's passed away and no one ever uses the fucking Christmas tree anymore. So um, to be honest with you, I don't know when we put it up. Um, but yeah, it's probably usually the first couple of weekends in December we put it up. Um, I obviously put mine up in the first. Um, my little Christmas tree. I usually put mine up in the first when I have like with my Christmas tree I put mine up in the first um, But it really depends on who decorates it. Well, there's Usually we have two trees and the big green one It used to be my mum that would decorate it and I would put the star on top of the tree and my parents would put the tree up and then my mum would decorate it and then I would put the star on top of the tree or angel in that case um, and then the little white Christmas tree with multicoloured baubles. My mum will, me and my mum will put it up and then my mum will wrap the right lights around it and my dad will sit and do nothing and I will put the baubles on it. I hate putting lights on a tree so I always get my mum to do it. Um, so she puts the lights on it but um, I decorate it. Number nine, is your Christmas tree real or fake? Both are fake. 
Um, all of our Christmas trees are fake. Um, we don't have a real one. I think my mum might have one day, one time had a real one, but we have fake Christmas trees. We never go and buy Christmas trees. I don't know where we would go to buy one in Scotland, if I'm being honest with you. Don't have a clue. Number 10, peeking at gifts or be surprised. I have zero patience uh, at all. So um, when I was younger, I always used to run around trying to peek for gifts. Now I've got to an age where I'm like keen keep myself distracted and don't go looking for gifts. But I did when I was younger. Number 11, uh, show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. I don't actually have one. I don't have an ugly Christmas sweater. I only have one Christmas jumper and you'll have seen it in a video. I love that Christmas jumper. That's not ugly to me. That's got a pug with like Elton John style glasses on it. It's amazing. So and it, it rings. It's like, it's what you would say is an ugly Christmas jumper, but to me it's not. So I'm not going to show it to you. Number 12, if you could be under the mistletoe with anyone, who would it be? Tom Felton. Like, are we even surprised? Definitely Tom Felton or Amelia Clark. God, she's so stunning. So either one of them. Number 13, does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? No. <laughs> no, my mum just makes the chicken and that's it and the stuffing. She just, uh, she makes it all and me and my dad eat it. Um, but I am going to make Brussels sprouts this year. I am making like Brussels sprouts with bacon this year so I'm going to try that. We'll see how well that goes down. Um, number 14, are you a pro present wrapper or do you feel miserably? <laughs> Bitch please, I am a pro present wrapper. I spend far too much time and money making presents, let's be honest. Number 15, have you ever gone Christmas caroling? No, I haven't. We don't really Christmas carol around here in Scotland. It's not really a big thing. But if it helps, I was in the school choir in primary school and um, we used to go um, caroling all the time. So technically I have gone Christmas caroling, but we used to go to like the, the church and I used to sing carols all the time. That was the best bit because you got out of school to do it. So I remember at one point we did it for Hansel. We used to um, support a charity called Hansel Village. I don't know if Doonfoot still does it, but we did it. And um, we went, I remember once going to the, um, the like, a, a centre in air, um, the Kyle Centre and standing in there with like donations and wrapped in tinsel saying the carols and I remember my dad coming to watch, it was so cute. Number 16, what tops your tree? Well this tree, you can't really see it, but it is, I'll take it off for you, just to show you. It is from the range and it is a, a, a reindeer, like this, and it's meant to be like a big decoration for a tree, but I'm using it on this teeny tree as a um, topper. Um, on the multicoloured Christmas tree, it is a purple star that is broken, and on our green tree, it's an angel. So there you go, that's what tops our trees. Number 17, do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you stick to them? I don't know. I mean, I do usually make New Year's resolutions. I'm going to do, but I'm not doing resolutions anymore. I'm doing goals. As you will see, on the 1st of January, I'm uploading a video at 5pm called 2019 Goals. And it's basically my goals for the year. So basically what I want to achieve in the year. Nothing to do with like, oh, I want to lose weight. Oh, I want to, yes, I do want to lose weight, but I'm, I'm gonna, I'm quite happy with my body just now. So I'm gonna embrace your body. So I'm just gonna make goals and try and achieve them. Um, and number 18, finally, you have been granted one Christmas wish. What will it be? Um, I think I wish um, to, I don't know what I wish for. I wish for a boyfriend. <laughs> I wish for a relationship. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I wish for. I think I just wish for um, happiness and for everything to just be a really good year. I think I just wish for 2019 to be a really good year. I think that's all I wish for. So that was it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I Okay, so I will not see you Friday, nor will I see you for a magical Monday. I am not uploading those two days, but I am doing Vlogmas all the way to Christmas. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was good for you. Um, and yeah, I will see you every day for Vlogmas. See ya. Bye.